Welcome back to One on One with Dr. Sarah with Dirty Water Media. We're here in Boston with Danielle Bradbury. Welcome Hi. to the show. It's your first time. I'm very excited to have yeah, you. Yeah, this is a cool venue. Isn't it's it? Really cool, yeah. Did you do your rehearsing? Did you know you were going to spin around? Um, I, they did tell me that, okay. but when it started going, I was like, okay, this is pretty cool. It doesn't go too fast, which okay. is good. You don't get dizzy. I always no. wonder when artists go on there. If don't, they yeah, it doesn't move that, like, fast enough to make you feel anything. Like, you're, like you need a little, like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so this has been a busy week. The CMT Awards, you crushed it. I want to talk about your outfit. Oh. That was amazing. <laughs> that white dress. Who made that? Yeah. Um, oh, God. They, let me try to remember. There Somebody in a size that I don't wear. <laughs> it was it was a really long name, um, but they. I mean, as soon as I saw that dress, not even on, I was like, okay, I'm I need this dress. On. Yes. And it it was cool because it was a two piece. Uh, the jack it was like a jacket yes, that jacket. clipped right here. Yeah. So if I wanted to, I could take that off and it'd be a strapless dress. Yeah, it was amazing. So pretty. Do you get to keep it? I did not. Oh, I did not. Oh, I know. Right. But hopefully, I'll I'll wear more from them. I'll get the name too. So. When she gets that name, she's gonna be wearing a lot. Yeah. Of it. Yeah. <laughs> what was it like that night? Did you guys go out after? Well, uh, the night was awesome. Mm -hmm. I mean, I love those award shows and especially CMT awards because it's so it's kind of more laid back. Shuck. Yes. Mm -hmm. And so a lot of, I mean, a lot of actors and a lot of like um, athletes and a lot of people, like big people love to come to that one because it is so, so chill. normal. Yes. Yeah. And so I get so starstruck every time I see somebody. Like yeah. one of the years, a lot of the Texans football players, I'm from Texas, right. were there and I was like, oh my God, this is You're so like, cool. Hi, do you want my number? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. If I was there with you, I'd be like, her number is. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm a good sidekick. Really I'm good. Yeah. very, very good at that. Um, <laughs> but yeah, the awards are so fun. That night was really cool. I got to see Blake. I ran up to him and hugged right. him. Big bear hug. It was a um, reunion. Yes, it was. <laughs> and so, yeah, the shows were great. My favorite was Carrie Underwood. Of course. I love her so much. She was yeah. sitting right in front of me. And I she was? was? Like, oh, I would have yes. been like... Hi, <laughs> I'm Danielle Bradbury. Did you, see me? Did you see me on the voice? Yeah, yeah, she's amazing. I definitely, she's one of my favorites. Oh my gosh, she was yeah. so pretty. I was obsessed with her makeup, so we all know that she goes to Parlor 3 in oh, Nashville. Oh, Nashville. Nice. I go there every time I'm there. Oh, there you go. Yes. <laughs> yep. Those girls are great. That's awesome. I highly recommend them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll keep that in mind. Three. Yes. <laughs> so, did you do CMA Fest as well? It's a crazy week. It's my first time not being there in a long time. Yeah, yeah. I started it off um, with a couple of things. I did perform down there. Um, this is actually the first year I haven't performed or anything. Okay. Because um, I had to leave to do some she shows. She had to go spin around on the I went stage. to go <laughs> spin around on the stage, yes. Um, so, it was kind of like... Okay, it is kind of nice to leave the craziness because it Nashville is. is so packed. It's, it's talk about bad traffic already, and, and then, then and everybody. Is. <laughs> and it's so hot. And I'll Very leave like hot. I used to leave interviews or friends who might be recording. Yeah, yeah. And I could just be like on the side of the road, and people like, and I'd be too totally dressed up because you're like yeah. back from events, and you're like. Is somebody gonna kidnap me? Like that's how crazy busy it's it is. So and, like, I oh. feel sorry for the fans because they're outside <laughs> and it's hot. Twenty four seven. But I mean, they're having the best time, so yeah. it's really cool. It is fun. If you guys can ever go to the CMA Fest, highly recommend. It. Yeah, there's a lot. And she'll to probably do. be performing. <laughs> she'll be there next year. Yes, so. I will. <laughs> so what else do you have coming up for the rest of the summer? Oh man, um, a lot of these type of shows, just mm -hmm. festivals, um, right. uh, we're starting to think about tours, upcoming tours, we don't mm -hmm. have anything just yet, um, but I'm ex I am love touring, and especially if you can tour with people that you love, and yeah. they're so talented, and, um, but yeah, just a lot of festivals, and I'm getting back into songwriting mm -hmm. in Nashville a lot, and so it's it's all good. I'm ready for the summer. I know, <laughs> so am I. It's really yeah. nice day, actually, for the first time here in the oh, Boston awesome. area, so yeah. that's great. So tell me, I saw on the socials that it looks like you're going to be on Chris Lane's second album. Did you guys record? I am, like... yeah. Um, yeah, he is so awesome. Uh, uh, it was kind of a random text or request he was like you know I'm, I'm working on my new album I have this one song that I think would sound really cool with the girl artist on it uh -huh. and not long before that we had an acoustic uh, guitar pool together oh. and so that was the first time I did that with him and we just 
we hit it off um, and just hearing him sing and I guess he heard me and it was just it worked out perfectly and it's, the song is called Without You which oh. is it's a good it's a good song I can't I wait hear for it. everyone to hear it I can't wait to hear it because you both are kind of my face saying, <laughs> I'm watching you she's a little blonde so I know what you're up to but, <laughs> but other than that I cannot wait to hear that yes. you guys are two of my favorite singers oh that's your awesome your voice is amazing Guys, she sings Sway and mm -hmm. Worth It. Oh my god. Oh, Your thank vocals you. on that. <laughs> I try to copy them in the car. I might oh. I'm gonna send it to you. <laughs> what is that? I like? thought it sounds amazing. <laughs> yeah. Sure. sure. Yeah. yeah. Alright, so where can everybody reach out to you on the socials? Um, well, they can reach out to me on Instagram. Uh, they can reach out Twitter, Facebook. My website is DanielleBradbury.com, and a lot of my socials are on that as well. So I'm anywhere. <laughs> anywhere. She'll answer you. No worries. Yes. All right. She oh, I needs found the name of the dress. Oh, this is the dress. Hold okay. Time out. It's Luciana Balderrama. It's a really so I had to remember. That's a tough name to remember. I was like Luciana. Geez. None of us could have remembered that at the time. Yes. But hit us both up, because I like dresses too. <laughs> <laughs> no, they, they are amazing. Yeah, so. that dress looked amazing. <laughs> if you guys need to see that, just Google it. That dress was amazing. Yes. All right. <laughs> All right, she needs to jump on stage here in Coasa, Massachusetts. So this is Dr. Sarah from Dirty Water Media, and we'll see you guys soon. Have a good one. <laughs>